Hey friends, it has been a really long time since I've read you a book and so I wanted to do that right now today. Good afternoon, my name is Erin Maxfield Steele and I am the priest at St. George's Episcopal Church and I put on a shirt just for you guys. I don't know if you know Noel, but Noel Schwartz, she is from Memphis and this is a zoo shirt from the Memphis Zoo. It's one of my favorite t-shirts. So, speaking of zoos and animals, we are going to read a book called Click Clack Moo, Cows That Type. And I'm going to flip it around so you can see it. Click Clack Moo, Cows That Type. I'm going to try to moo like a cow because I grew up around a lot of cows and I love them. This book is by Doreen Cronin and the pictures are by Betsy Lewin. And right there is a baby monitor, and if the baby starts making noises, that means that he is up from a nap, and we'll go get him, and we'll keep reading. Click, clack, moo. Cows that type. This is for my dad. To Sue Dooley. Farmer Brown has a problem. His cows like to type. All day long he hears, click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. That's Farmer Brown. At first he couldn't believe his ears. Cows that type? Impossible. Clickety clack, moo. Clickety clack, moo. Clickety clack, moo. I'm gonna just say moo because I haven't been around cows in a long time and my moos do not sound like cow moos. So there he is going to check it out. Then he couldn't believe his eyes. And here's the note on the door. Dear Farmer Brown, the barn is very cold at night. We'd like some electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. It was bad enough that the cows had found an old typewriter in the barn. Now they wanted electric blankets. No way, said Farmer Brown. No electric blankets. So the cows went on strike. They left a note on the barn door. Sorry, we're closed. No milk today. You see, this is Farmer Brown's shadow in the background. <laughs> He's not very happy. No milk today, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard the cows busy at work. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety, clack, moo. The next day, he got another note. Dear Farmer Brown, the hens are cold too. They'd like electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. The cows were growing impatient with the farmer. They left a new note on the barn door. Closed, no milk, no eggs. No eggs, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard them. Click, clack, moo. Click, clack, moo. Clickety, clack, moo. Cows that type. Hens on strike. Who ever heard of such a thing? How can I run a farm with no milk and no eggs? Farmer Brown was furious. Farmer Brown got out his own typewriter. Dear cows and hens, there will be no electric blankets. You are cows and hens. I demand milk and eggs. Sincerely, Farmer Brown. Duck was a neutral party. So he brought the ultimatum to the cows. The cows held an emergency meeting. All the animals gathered around the barn to snoop but none of them could understand Moo. 
All night long, Farmer Brown waited for an answer. Doc knocked on the door early the next morning. He handed Farmer Brown a note. Dear Farmer Brown, we will exchange our typewriter for electric blankets. Leave them outside the barn door, and we will send Duck over with the typewriter. Sincerely, the cows. Uh-oh, I don't know if you can hear it, but there is an unhappy baby. So we're going to go scoop him up and bring him outside, and then we'll finish our story. Are you sad when you wake up sometimes? You, you got him, babe? Okay, his daddy's got him. Sometimes when I wake up, I'm not very happy. Most of the time I'm pretty happy though. One thing that adults get because it doesn't stunt our growth because we're all done growing is coffee. And coffee really helps when I wake up. But babies don't get coffee. Okay, so we're gonna continue. So what just happened? Farmer Brown just got the note from the duck saying that they will exchange their typewriter um, for electric blankets. Okay. Farmer Brown decided this was a good deal. He left the blankets next to the barn door and waited for Duck to come with the typewriter. Do you see here are the chickens, the hens? Hens are female chickens and they're all cuddled up under an electric blanket and then each cow has her own electric blanket. I love electric blankets, they're very cozy. The next morning he got a note, Dear Farmer Brown, the pond is quite boring. We'd like a diving board. Sincerely, the ducks. Click, clack, quack. Click, clack, quack. Clickety, clack, quack. And there they are typing. And there they are with their diving board. So they got their way in the end. Hey Beth and Isaac, maybe Mark, maybe Barbara. I always forget your dog's name. Good to see you guys. Hope you enjoyed this story and I hope you enjoy the day. It is cloudy, but it's also Sunday. It is, it's partly cloudy and partly sunny. So have fun outside and I hope you're doing well in your house and miss all of you. Bye.